Hello everyone and welcome to Is Vigor Worth Playing in 2022? Well, the answer is yes, definitely. Vigor is 100% worth playing in this year. Well, I haven't played that much of this game, but I recently started this year. And I think it's definitely worth playing because I just played few matches and give a few turns here and there to check out that if this if it really has a player base and players are playing or not definitely the matchmaking time was around two to three minutes every time i match for any uh, game mode but maximum that it went for four minutes and it's not because the players are not playing this game it's only because the matchmaking system of this game is like that so here are a few things that i did while playing some game to just showcase you how exactly the game plays in 2022 let's see here so I just hopped out my base or shelter and quickly checked out my loadout and collected my raw material and food material that are definite, definitely very necessary items in order to upgrade your shelter fully and then hopped into one encounter mode without any loadout just not to take any risk of losing any more of my gears so it was I tried to make a cool run like giving high five to the real players but did not get a return favor as I expected so I had to hide in the bush and then wait as their encounter finished and as soon as they finished fighting I just left the encounter mode uh, gathering whatever loot I got. So next time I decided to take a proper loadout keeping in mind the previous encounter and I took one AKM with 60 rounds of 7.62 ammo and few of the consumables like caffeine, disinfectant and one mortar in case if someone is camping inside I could just throw back mortar at him. Then did some of my training warm up of my 7.62 ammo AKM. And the game decided to give me a dark mode which I absolutely don't like because of I cannot see the enemies around us and it's, it's I, I just don't like the feel of the darkness in the area. So I just hopped on and uh, moved into the area to search for loot, see if I can gather loot. I really needed a lot of chemicals, you know, to, uh, to upgrade my weapons uh, workbench so that I could craft more like powerful weapons in the game i really needed more of the chemicals but i i was grabbing anything i found in the way i love akm this is like my favorite gums in almost all the shooters i play i just love this gum i don't know why most of the players in the lobby took the bonus token like you get the more loot everybody gets more loot once you have taken that token so i was also getting a quite decent loot here and there there was some fight going on in that region between the players so I definitely wanted to third party them so I went in there hoping to get some of the kills and also some of the loots if I can. I was not fully aware though but uh, I heard some footsteps uh, around this area so I just snuck up behind this uh, railing or you can say the fence, steel fence maybe just to see if anyone is there. Yeah there he is. There he is. Was just moving around so I tried to aim him well difficult to aim because the recoil in this game is pretty hard and it's quite realistic and brutal also so I decided to aim and kill him okay I got one and as soon as I was decided to loot him I heard another foot and I just couldn't aim him. And I was almost dead and then suddenly a headshot connected and he was dead. So it was pretty much game of luck here because he might have taken me out anyway. So once I looted everything in this, both the players crates, I got good loot here. But the problem was that I did not use the bonus token. Okay, insurance token. What does insurance token does is that if you have taken it apart from the loot from the drop, Whatever loot you have taken in the encounter, it stays with you even if you die in the encounter. So I haven't taken that token and I had to pay the price because once I moved in from here, another player was waiting for me somewhere in the bush and I saw him but it was good aim. So I had to, you know, 
face the death <laughs> or whatever you say. Then after coming back to Shalpur with almost nothing in possession and with despair, I decided to give a try in emulation mode and recently enough I found a match within 2 minutes and I had a blast playing this mode because we also grabbed good victory here. My team were for snapping few kills here and there and even I took chances and got decent kills. Like there was a guy here and here. <laughs> I did not aim properly and I was hitting shot in the uh, metal. Well, in the end, I have to only say this that I'm having a blast playing this game right now, so it's definitely worth playing it on your request. Thank you for watching the video. I hope you enjoy the content. Please make sure to come back again. Thank you.